In Origin, we have the capability to add an embedded graph to a worksheet, which can be beneficial for organizing your graphs with your data. In 2018b, the functionality of the dialog for selecting and adding a graph as a sheet has changed a little. In my first example, I have multiple graphs within a folder. To add a graph, simply right-click the Sheet tab and select Add Graph to Sheet. A dialog will appear. Graph 2 is initially chosen as the graph that will be added because it is the last graph that I had activated. To choose a different graph, simply activate another graph in the folder. Then select Done. Now Graph 4 is added as its own sheet in the workbook. To edit the graph, simply double-click. I can then go ahead and make changes to this graph. To return the graph back to the sheet, simply select the arrow key. If I want to restore the graph so that it is no longer embedded in the workbook, simply right-click and select Restore Window. If I create a new graph and immediately right-click the Sheet tab, the Add Graph to Sheet will assume you want to add the newly created graph. See that it is suggesting adding Graph 5, my recently created graph. Let's say another folder in my project only contains one graph. When I right-click the Sheet tab, similar to the previous example, the Add Graph to Sheet will assume the graph that I want to add is Graph 1. This is because Graph 1 is the only graph in this folder, and I do not have the capability to add graphs from different folders into this workbook. This concludes this tutorial on adding a graph to the sheet.